everyone wants to matter in high school. But the truth, <laughs> no one really does. And I know what you're thinking. Okay, don't be so melodramatic. But wanna know what I'm thinking? Shut it. I'm Stephanie Howard, the hot girl on the left, and I actually do matter. The slightly less hot girl next to me is my BFF, Taylor Turner. She's such a follower. Watch this. In movies, the plain girl always gets the voiceover, which is so anti-fair. I know you'd rather hear pretty girl thoughts. But honestly, popular girls like me don't waste our time thinking. We're much too busy. Oh. Hey, watch where you're going. Yeah, little Miss No Sunshine. You walked into me. <sighs> it was brand new. It's fine to me. Now, respect my space and get out of my face. Taylor! Red nails. Oh my god, I love this song. She's reckless with the heart. She steals. She spends money. She doesn't learn. Her life sits down. She's a Like clockwork, 9 p.m. and Miss B takes a ride on the crazy train. Music over all your loud banging. I will tell your father that he gets home. <laughs> I will tell him how rotten you are. Nobody cares, you old hag. You have much manners to learn. Look who's talking. How about not ringing my doorbell 17 million times? Yeah, it's kind of annoying. <laughs> I even stop ringing doorbell when you stop playing music. <laughs> it's my house. I can play whatever I want, whenever I want. And there's nothing you can do about it. You are mean girls. I think you want me to show you how to be nice, yes? As if. Yeah, it's totally if. <laughs> well, thanks so much for stopping by, Miss Biazovich. <sighs> Take care. I will teach you, both of you. Stop it! Leave us alone! <gasps> you better be nice, girls. <gasps> Ow! Taylor, Taylor, my hair! I like she took an extra dose of wacko tonight. The donut felt like ice. It's mega weird. She's gonna pay. Big time. Hello. Hi, is this Amanda Hagenkiss? You have wrong number. I need Amanda Hagenkiss. I don't know Amanda Hagenkiss. Who'd want to hug and kiss an old hag like you, anyway? <laughs> Hello. Good evening, madam. This is the pest control board. We've had reports of a jerk infestation in your apartment. Hello. I know who is this. You had best pretend this is a wrong number or else. What are you gonna do about it? No mercy for mean girls. Get over here. Can you hear anything? It's all muffled. All I hear is mumble, mumble, mumble. I don't know why that old lady was always complaining. These walls are thick as like, it's like walls. Do 
on the move. Okay. Tell me what's happening. Okay. Um, the paramedics just left. The new guys just walk past. Oh, the younger one is way cute. Those guys are from the morgue. You know what this means, don't you? It means Miss Vyazovich is dead. No, it means when Hottie Moore guy walks out, I need to look cuter than I already do. Help me with my hair. Okay, what is taking him so long? Maybe he's too busy taking care of Miss Biazovich's dead body to come out and see how good your hair looks. <laughs> it does look good, doesn't it? <laughs> Look, I don't want to see a dead body. Tell me when they're gone. I'm gonna give him my number. Wait, don't leave me. Stephanie. Hey, I can't believe she's flirting with him over Miss B's body. I can't believe I'm looking. Why am I looking? Supposed to be silent, sustained reading, not loud, constant talking. I tried texting the number, but my message just bounced back. So unfair. It's like your phone is talk blocking you. Way creepy. Less fix hair, more fix you. They're just stupid text messages. But it's like whoever's sending them is watching you. I know who's sending the messages. It's Hottie Mort guy. I gave him my number. He's totally flirting. Weird way to flirt. It's him. How do I look? Well, he can't see you through the phone. Cuteness is a state of mind. You can hear how hot I am through my voice. Hello? What? Say something. Yeah. That's definitely not a haughty morgue guy. I'm calling them back. Be careful. It's just a phone call. What could possibly happen? Coincidence, right? You calling in Miss B's phone ringing? Right. It doesn't mean anything. You answer it. No way, it's your phone. Now you have to. It's your phone. I don't know if it's really coming from Miss B's apartment. Baby. Someone's in there. No one is in there. Okay, Miss B lived alone, and she's dead, remember? I want to go home. No. No, not until we figure out what's going on. 
Someone's punking us. No one fucks me. Well, we should wait till your dad gets home. Tay, you're just getting worked up, okay? There's nothing going on. We can't just break into Mrs. B's apartment. That'd be, um, bad. We don't have to. Yeah, my, my dad took care of her cat when she was out of town once. Pretty sure he still has the key. Come on. Hello? Is there anyone in here? No? Okay, we can go. Stop it. Shh. Stop it. Here, shh. Oh, gross. Hello, hoarders much? <clears throat> what was that? Do you see that? Why wouldn't the paramedics blow these out? Okay, I'm scared. Let's get out of here. Not until we figure out what made the noise. That's what made the sound. It was just her headboard. Now we can go. Wait. You had to push it to make the sound. So what pushed it before? You should call the number back. Uh, just do it. go to the library and work on your research papers. Kim, what is that supposed to be? Um, it kind of looks like an eye. Okay, I'm putting a stop to this. Crank calling us now. Okay, well, what am I supposed to do when my mom calls and I on my phone? I don't know. Just tell her you lost it or something, okay? We'll both say that. Adriana, I have a question. Yes, you are a terrible person. <laughs> that wasn't my question. Look, I'm not interested in whatever mean things you have to say, so. Whenever I'm mean to you. You're always mean. To everyone. Whatever, I'm sorry, okay? This is important. Creepy things have been happening. And I thought you might be able to help. You know, since you're all gothy and into weird, dark stuff. No, I think I'm weird, thank you. Oh, no, she's just upset. Her neighbor... This old, freaky woman. Well, she died, and this is crazy, but she started sending us these messages. Weird, freaky text messages. I think she's haunting us. And I thought maybe you're a witch. You know, since you always dress in black. So do you know any protection spells or anything equally nerdy that might help us? Okay, one, I'm not a witch because two, witches are so passe. And three, do you really think you're being haunted? Because four, I might be able to help. Please. I'll never make fun of you to your face again, I promise. My Uncle Constantine is an expert in that stuff. Here's his address. I'll tell him to expect you after school. Hey, excuse me, are you Stephanie Howard? Uh-huh. It's for you. They said it's an emergency. Your heart will be ground and thrown to the wolves. Please. We have to hurry. You little girls lost? Um, no. I mean, hey. Are you Uncle Constantine? 
I'm Stephanie. This is Taylor. We're, uh, we're friends with your niece, Adriana. Hmm. Adriana called me about you. Hmm. She told me you need protection. Old gypsy woman put curse on you, yes? Yes. I can see a dark presence in your morals. It's very bad. Very strong. Adriana was right to send you to me. Oh, I knew that old hag hated me. Serves her right, she's dead. Dead? You girls are in grave danger. Well, well can you help us? Yes, let me see. <sighs> Hellebore leaves. Oh, oh they smell like feet. <coughs> yes, but they keep you safe. Put them around your bed at night. Very important. Don't forget. You must do this before you go to sleep. Like oh, we're ever gonna sleep again. What do we owe you? No charge. I would do anything to help friends of my niece. Do what Constantine tells you, girls. Your lives depend on it. Okay. Okay. And just to be safe. Can you sleep over tonight? Well, it's a school night. Come on, my dad won't be home from work until super late. Please, 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 please. Well, I guess it is the safest place. Since he is a protection herbs. <sighs> oh, my whole room smells like feet. Do you think they'll really keep Mrs. B away if she comes for us? They better. Adriana's gonna pay if a creepy uncle get us big stuff. You don't learn your lessons yet. I make you nice girl. <laughs> <laughs> now what? She's gonna kill us! Why did you lead us in here? We're trapped! She's following you! There's something, Stephanie! Oh, they're getting bigger! You said do something! to be nice, Stephanie. I swear, please just let us go. You know more about me with this? I know more blah, blah, whatever. Yes, I'm sorry, fine. I swear a hundred times. Steph, stop. Be nice like she said. I am being nice. <sighs> She's the one who can't stop being a disgusting, awful old hag. <laughs> I would have listened to your friend. She has good in her. Not you. You are a rotten girl to the core. Ah, video. Sister, stop it! Get away from me! <laughs> Get away from me! Stop it! <laughs> what did you do to her? Respect my Let space. Get out of face. Grandma B did it. With our help, yes? Stephanie Howard will never mess with me. Again. Yeah. 